Arsing family devastated by a tragedy three years ago says it's being victimized all over again. Years of thefts from a local cemetery brings calls for action. Reporter Lacey Darrow is on your side with the story. The Sauer family visits their daughter in the Marsing Homedale Cemetery, bringing with them gifts that they know that she would like. But what happens when those gifts start disappearing? Shauna Sauer lost her daughter Taylor three years ago in a car accident. Every couple of weeks, she makes a trip to her daughter's grave to visit and decorate. But recently, those decorations are disappearing. We always bring out new flowers and clean our headstone and everything. Uh, down to the styrofoam that the flowers are pushed in have been taken. Bruce Benson, caretaker for the cemetery, said in years prior, things would get stolen once in a great while, but in the last two or three years, things have gotten bad. I'm, I'm the one that's here. I'm the one that everybody looks at first. And it's frustrating to, to explain to them that I'm not taking it. Members of the cemetery board believe that people are coming in and taking the nicer things and then turning around and selling them for money. It's been very difficult for us, and it's, it's progressively getting worse. So bad, in fact, they are in talks to get security cameras installed. With so many different families visiting the plots, cemetery board members say it can be difficult to tell who is taking things that don't belong to them. We own the deed to the plot, so coming here and taking something off of my daughter's grave is no different than walking in my house and taking something out of my house. Regardless of how many gifts go missing, Shauna says she will continue to decorate her daughter's grave. The sad thing is, is when I see something gone, um, instead of saying, well, I'm not going to put anything out there, I would never do that because I want her headstone to be as beautiful as she was. While I was out covering the story, a man approached me and told me that his mother recently had a number of decorations stolen from a grave in the area. Everyone that I talked to had the same thing to say. They all just want it to stop. Live in studio, Lacey Darrow, 6 on your side.